Will you stop staring at my breast? She screams, except she doesn't use the word breast. She uses a word rather coarser than that. For a second, I am too stunned to speak. Me, as if I would ever stare at the ladies. Never. I mean, what would my mother say? I reach out over the desk, just meaning to comfort her. And she jumps back, knocking her chair over. Don't you dare lay your filthy fingers on me, she says. Except she doesn't use the word filthy. Look, I say, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. One of her fellow workers comes over, a big man, and he grabs me. He deposits me none too gently on the pavement outside. It's at times like this I feel like giving in. Sitting in a puddle on a pavement. Kids whizzing past me and all sorts of boards and blades. All of them laughing. None of them stopping to help. I pick myself up. Through the window of the job centre, I can see the lady. I tap on the window to try and apologise. I didn't mean to stare at your breasts. All right?